My name is Larry Evans. The Marina Ace. And the dimensions are 655 by 106. Brady's Island Turning Basin. And uh, it's approximately 888.50 to play with. And, uh, like I said, this thing's close to 700. So it's not a whole lot of room to play with. Midship. Midship. I got that outbound car here. This is a car carrier. It's a north wind blowing today and uh, quite a bit of cell area. The captain told me it was 5,750 square meters of cell area. So, yeah, you do catch a lot of wind. Starboard 10. Starboard 10. And this GPS system that we're using is very accurate, uh, even more accurate than the ship's GPS, so that's why we use our own antennas and everything. It's supposedly accurate within a meter. It's called a differential GPS, it's a D GPS. They use the old RAN towers, they go with the, the satellites and make it very, very accurate. Yeah. 
invece Going by Exxon again, eye level. Midship, Midship. starboard 20. Starboard 20. And all the barges at the Exxon berth are well out of sight. I'm 300 feet off the berth. Can't see anything. Overtaking the Arandus. Once he goes out of sight, he will be completely out of my vision there where I will not see him the entire length of the ship and then some. I'm turning a tad early here to give him plenty of room, so he'll still be three or four hundred feet from me. Midship. Midship. But I, I wanted to show this uh, wheelhouse being 166 feet from the bow. It makes a huge difference in visibility, and the, uh, the vents that you see here do not help. Again, I'm filming at eye level. Here's a tow meeting me on. Two whistles that were coming underneath the Jesse Jones Bridge. Give you a sense of visibility. I'm gonna, again, we're eye level, center line of the ship, twisting a little bit to the right here. Here we are in Crown Bend, a ship at Crown. You can barely see him, and I'm actually down on the bank a little more than normal um, just because you can't see. At night I think this would be uh, not much fun. Again inbound here coming on the Texaco slip. Um, I'd be pretty uncomfortable at night not being able to see these landmarks very well. So, uh, I'm, I'm not especially comfortable even in daylight here, but it's just getting darker. I'm glad uh, the, the dock isn't too far away. It's getting dusk. Not good enough daylight to see here, but this is coming on Manchester. Again, we're still at eye level. Starboard 10. Starboard 10. I wouldn't like this at night. 